All right, so we got Fortnite Season 4, everything new, explained. Let's get right into the Fortnite video. Season 4 has officially launched, and half the map is turned to chrome. There's multiple new guns, a mythic yes, boss sir. to fight, and transforming into a metallic blob is ridiculously overpowered. So, let's break yes. down everything I've you need like to know. Season 4 has completely like changed Fortnite. I mean, really, it made everything shiny, but this chrome allows you to phase around, dash through walls, and heal up. It's like a combination of sand tunneling and shadow stones, and you can turn <laughs> yourself by using the new splash what item. Not only will you become immune to fire the same damage, time. but you'll also move faster and walk through walls if you don't want to become chrome this grenade still lets you go through just throw the splash at any wall and walk straight in and that really? brings us to the most important poi of season four herald sanctum which has replaced yes, the sanctuary and is a location full of chrome you can automatically dash around in this place and there's even a huge tornado that gives bro listen let me just say something bro the whole that this little blob thing right here bro i don't even like the, know like the official name of it but like this blob thing right here bro is op you can literally escape from anything it's absolutely full of chrome bro. you can automatically dash around in this place and there's even a huge tornado that gives you the effects which is the first time we've seen one that doesn't move there's not much loot at this boi and you'll find it hard to get shields but there's a reason okay. for that it's the home of fortnite's latest villain the herald she summons chrome uh, wolves during her boss yeah. battle and has a lot of health but yeah, it's pretty yeah. achievable if you have some teammates or stand on the ledge above the new i haven't even like uh went up against her yet i haven't played the um once defeated, i haven't she played drops a uh, brand new mythic yet. burst rifle which absolutely shreds enemies and that's about all the loot at this place but luckily there's a better poi in season four her, that burst rifle is actually the volcano now clean, contains honest. an updated version of lazy with the fire ship being suspended yes, in the air the balloons holding it up have a secret function too walk into them and you'll be blasted into the sky just like a geyser which really gives me nostalgia from chapter one's volcano hey that gwen's uh, one thing i want to say is that gwen's spider-man's outfit is absolutely amazing well it's not spider-man spider girl i'm gonna call i call it spider girl but that Gwen suit is amazing. Your own base, you might have come across a mysterious key in your inventory. These are dropped randomly in chests and floor loot, but if you get one key, your mini map will update with the locations of new vaults. Most of them are low security, but you might be wondering what these larger ones are. Well, if you okay. find yourself with two keys, you can unlock a high security vault that gives the maximum amount of loot. Some people may prefer this really? over the old key card system, which definitely makes things more RNG. But if you're wanting to make the most of your skills, then season four has plenty of items to help you. For zero build players, the port of fort has been vaulted but don't worry because it's been replaced with a brand new port of bunker a huge oh my complaint God. last season was that the old forts were super tall and gave away your position so epic answer with the bunker a more compact base that people are gonna love it's followed by a secret change to oh sliding my God. that'll make a huge difference i've seen clips like this on instagram where like you can slide and like you bump somebody like i've seen nick a30 uh, Instagram where he, like he would do this slide and he bumped people like off of like the blimp and stuff like that It was absolutely hilarious and it may not seem like much but You can now kick enemies while sliding yeah, into really them, while which sliding. Is That's for OP. some insane plays and so with the new season we say goodbye to old crossovers such as the Indiana uh, Jones Indiana Temple. Jones this uh, has been replaced with a new area is, named is, Shimmering though. Shrine It's now covered in chrome and the puzzle inside has been removed You'll be surprised by a brand new weapon that changes rarity in the middle of a match. You can find really? the Evo Chrome Burst Rifle, which starts at Uncommon. This includes a unique bar underneath the name, which tracks your damage. Every time you eliminate or hurt an enemy, this bar goes up and changes the gun rarity. You can take this thing all the way from Uncommon to Mythic in a single match. There's also a what? shotgun version of the Evo Chrome, and it has a new reticle when aiming. I've actually, square, I've, have I used a shotgun before? No, I, I, ooh, While you run around with I these have. guns, make sure to stop by the brand new Season 4 locations like Cloudy Condos. Because of the chrome spreading these places are also floating in the air this used to be condo canyon but now it is completely in the sky and you can get up there with zip lines and a new feature these are the really? launchers which propel you in a certain direction and can be found in all of the new pois including fort i've Jonesy. actually seen that before this is the new version fort of the joneses Jonesy. and it has this? a few layout changes mostly this huge platform but let me tell you there's plenty of wood to farm that actually looks sick don't I forget can't to lie. pick up the suppressed smg this is fine i've returned actually to used the game and they are all okay. over the I've map i've actually used that People before I've actually used a suppressed uh, SMG. Like, okay, I'll be honest. I did kind of lie at the beginning of the video. I have played the played the new season. Um, I think was it yesterday, and uh, I only did like uh one or two runs of it, and that's when I you know have to get off after like do videos or whatever. But I did get to use the SMG. I haven't used a shotgun yet to where like it would change rarity 
like in the middle of a gunfight. I didn't even know you like it, uh, it can do that. So that's actually pretty helpful. Finding a legendary and epic version, which might turn out to be totally overpowered. So we'll see how that goes. I've used the burst rifle. But I don't though. think anyone expected to load into season four and spot new wildlife in the game. Pro wolves are pretty scary, but you can now find chickens but and frogs easy, again. They were secretly vaulted they're last season like, beat, and have you finally shoot them returned. A few and that's not the only fan favorite feature to come back. Season four has brought the lever action shotgun and hunter's bolt action. These are both incredibly. Bro, the level action shot. I'm sorry, I'm pausing that, but the level action shotgun is absolute. I love it, bro. Look at this. Look at this. the only fan favorite feature to come back. Season four has brought the bro, lever action oh shotgun God, and hunter's bro, bolt the lever action. action bro, These are both oh incredibly I used that yesterday in, the in past, my, one of my runs that I did, bro. Be absolutely some of the most amazing. Guns of the season. The hunter sniper has a ton of damage increase I, along with I every single the, sniper the in the game, sniper. regardless sniper, of them be being vaulted. As for the lever action shotgun, you can now reload while aiming, and you've never been able to do that before. Wait, You're what? Also never able to I pet know wildlife, that. but thanks to today's update, any wolves or boars that you ride come with a pet button. Sorry. It's a simple change but i think we could all appreciate it now if you're skilled enough to get a victory royale by now make sure to enjoy your okay. brand new season four umbrella it's called the chrome umbrella because of course it is but make sure I mean, you I pay attention to this umbrella. insane secret because very a lot of things to check it. out bro. if you it's hire an new, npc uh, this season there's a new season. command wheel that lets you tell them what to do we all avoid these guys because you know they just wander around reveal your position but with these commands npcs might be more useful than ever and of course really? for the new season comes a new battle pass fortnite's worst kept Obviously. secret has finally been confirmed with the Paradigm now included as the Tier 1 skin. Although, she is missing armor, really? and as you can see, Paradigm is played by Brie Larson. If you do want to equip her 7 suit, well, that's available okay. on page 7, you get it? As for the other original characters, Bites is showcased on page 2, and they are covered in Chrome. I, uh... They get their own Dark Bargains quest set on October 6th. To shake okay. things up, there is a Grizz skin for page 4, and he's a bear who sick. controls a Slurp suit. That looks his really, really, really sick. That's a pretty cool reference. This is just the start of the season's insane battle pass, because Meow School is up next and she is a sister of kid followed by lennox rose an anime skin with tons of styles did i but buy the this final one? two skins are probably the most interesting of all which one Twin did i buy i one bought a skin today that let you switch between two different people using an emote this kid is technically a really? buy one get one free and of course for the final outfit of season Obviously four the there's gwen, the collab spider gwen, it's spider yeah. gwen she is taken straight out of the upcoming spider verse movie and her unmasked style is literally one to one this is one of the most accurate crossover skins we have ever seen and now that no, epic got like the rights to the really spider verse I, it's only a matter time before miles morales joins her and this yes, season gets sir. crazier with cypher pk's icon series set arriving in just a few days and bro shout out to cypher pk man's literally got his own skin in fortnite bro that's like one of my dreams i hopefully i can like be in like a video game one day but getting my own skin in fortnite that is like a dream for me so hopefully I, that will come true one day but bro shout out to cypher cypher bk I, he absolutely he deserves it the hero being available Honestly. for free in 46 days as the bonus skin speaking of oh, cypher really? he has a secret exotic item which creates a trap tower and epic accidentally put this in creative for you to try out and that brings us to some other incredible things that you secretly missed including season four's next weapon in the trailer the paradigm can be spotted using this item and it's officially called the unstable liquid gun we have no oh. idea how this literally what i said in a new update i was like bro this is definitely going to be like a, a new gun in the new in a new season it's a word but it's confirmed to be coming later in the season yeah that's you that should one. expect yeah. to see the first update in around two weeks so it's possible it could release then but you never really know speaking of upcoming secrets epic games accidentally revealed the next marvel Ooh. crossover without even knowing when today's update went live the fortnite asset pack was updated with a ton of emotes but epic yeah. uploaded the wrong image iron man. it's called iron man revealed and it shows a built-in emote Ooh. for the upcoming hulkbuster skin this is a mech suit that was designed by the seven in the zero war comics and will be included in the upcoming Iron Man Zero skin. Once issue five of the comics release, uh, expect to see this in the item shop. But I even though like... Spider Gwen is in season four, you won't be able to swing around while wearing her skin because one of the most beloved items in Fortnite has been secretly removed, and it's the grapple glove. With the new Chrome Blob feature, it's probably why Epic I got like rid of this, but glove. honestly, it'll hopefully return in season five. Obviously, and we yeah, don't the have Spider to wait until then for I, incredible I content. Fortnite yeah. has already prepared the mid-season update, which is scheduled to release on November 3rd. This will officially huh. unlock the Herald skin and could be in the middle of Fortnite Mares. By then the halloween season is gonna bring really? us a huge oh, update i can't, and I can't, I can't wait, wait to see what's in store for us many leaks have released talking about horror characters Black like freddy krueger yeah. michael myers or even That'd jason Voorhees coming to the game which that would be would really sweet be but for now they are not confirmed 
We have plenty of things to look forward to. There are dozens of cups, including a Cypher PK tournament and three new arena uh, divisions, man, Contender, hope, Challenger, uh, and Elite. And if I haven't mentioned Chrome enough eight. already in this video, it's going to spread even more as the season progresses. In the trailer, you can see Greasy Grove covered in silver, and who knows where else this will go. Paradise will oh, officially man. end on December 3rd, with insiders claiming that the next season will begin either on the 4th or maybe the 5th. Kind of depends okay. on the live event, and if the nothing is truly as terrifying as they claim. With leaks of a new map, first person mode, and an event at the end, this season has us looking for Fortnite first person mode would look absolutely amazing to a lot absolutely and i cannot amazing, wait to cover bro. it here first this has been tommy keep it oh here on God. top five gaming shout out to top five gaming for the video comment down below what you, what you guys think of the new season i think it's absolutely amazing i cannot wait until they bring out the new lava gun or i keep calling it the lava gun but you know it is what it is what you guys want to call it or not i cannot wait till they bring that out shout out to the cypher for his new icon skin as well uh, i'm super proud of him and um other than that um yeah comment down below what you guys think of the new season uh what should they add uh do you guys uh, you know are what do you guys think of you know some of the things that they took out and stuff like that and honestly i'll be honest bro epic games are too smart i don't think that they actually you know accidentally leaked that whole iron man thing i think it was meant to be put there for some reason but you know that's what i think personally but other than that i'll see you guys later for the next one i'm out and